What's up guys, welcome back to more Into the Flames gameplay where today we're going to be taking another look at the pumping update. Today we're going to be focusing on ground monitors and uh, the tanker again and the European truck. So you definitely want to catch this one guys, be sure to hit that thumbs up and let's get started. Let's see about getting a fire going. We want to go to emergencies and uh, what can we pull up? There is one in particular I'm wanting to pull up. Here we go, one Park Street box 420. That is the one we're gonna call up. We'll exit out of that. We do have the time frozen. We got random calls off. Uh, I don't know if I've shown you guys that, but if you wanna cut that stuff off, all you gotta do is hit escape, go to host options. Uh, you can pause your game time. You can turn off your uh, random emergencies. Uh, you can turn your medical calls on and off. Like That's how you, uh, you could control this stuff and change your map on the server, that sort of thing, so. Go ahead and get back into the game, return to game. So we got our fire going. Let's see where it's going to be at. It's going to be around here somewhere. Uh, should we just like right around the corner? Yeah, we do have smoke and it is going. We do have a fire. Okay, so uh, let's go ahead and get going. We'll hop in tanker two. Hope you guys are having a great weekend. Get this guy over here. Um, I think we're going to use him for ground monitor ops, really. That's what I did the other day. I spent a whole evening in game just kind of messing with the pumps and the tankers and everything and kind of figuring it out. So I think I have a way better understanding of uh, like fill the tank, pump the tank, that sort of thing. That was really what was kind of confusing to me, honestly, were those, uh, those features. Let's see. What do we look like on hydrants here? Um, yeah, okay, I think what would probably be best is to park this right here. Let's hop out, let's go to one of the European style trucks, or engines I should say, and we'll, uh, we'll grab a hydrant with him. These things are fast, man, they just, <laughs> they're squirrely. They're fast and very maneuverable. All right, let's, uh, I want to hurry up and get this water supply going because I want to get a ground monitor going on that tank. So that is what we're going to do. Let's, uh, let's park this guy right here. I don't know how this is going to work out as far as like intakes and stuff, to be honest. Uh, hose connections, uh, passenger. I don't think this unit is going to work out because I don't think it has... Uh, it does have a large diameter. Okay, yeah, so we actually can use this. We can use this. Let's do that then. Go to connections, uh, passenger intake. Actually, that should be driver intake, but it be alright. Uh, connect you up. Let's get it going. I just want to get some water going right now. That's all we want to do. Let's do, uh, equipment. There we go. Tools, hydrant wrench. And we'll probably come back and boost this later, but uh, I just want to get a supply going right now. That's all I want to do. All right, let's do hose connections. Yeah, that's not going to be here. Yeah, this is a little a little tricky here. I'm not used to it. Connections, uh, large diameter discharge four. Uh, exit out of you. All right, let's stretch this guy down to the tanker. We'll see how much water we get going. Uh, we'll do this. Let's see. Pump panel connections. Let's do uh, driver intake. There we go. All right. We're good with him. We should have water shortly. We're half full. We're half full. Some people may look at it as half empty, but I see it as half full. We're half full on the taker, so we got a little water. Hopefully, we'll get it filled up quick, and then we can get that uh, um, monitor going, the ground monitor. All right, let's go to pump panel. Let's do uh, tank fill. I don't know what uh, the max throttle on this thing is going to be. Not much. That is for certain. We'll talk about that in a bit. All right, so let's go to tank fill and uh, let's see. Let's pull you. And this one is half full as well, too. Wow. All right, and then we want to do uh, what was the discharge? I can't remember. What's the discharge on this thing? Uh, discharge four. Okay, let's go discharge four. Uh, con uh, not connections. Pump panel. Swear is not with it this morning. Saturday. 
There we go. We've got uh, 120 coming in and 120 going out. Yeah, it's not a whole lot on this hydrant, guys. It sure isn't. It's not a whole lot at all. But we're going to try to get this ground monitor set up and going, at least to put some water on the tank. That is my uh, my first concern is just keep the tank cool down. See what it's doing over here. Uh, so far, so good. Okay, so let's go back to... Uh, let's do discharge two. And let's bring this guy back around over here. Uh, let's drop him down. Yeah, let's drop him down there and let's get a ground monitor. The other day I had five, actually at one point I had like, yeah, five ground monitors going at one time. It was amazing. We were putting out a crazy amount of water. I was boosting the hydrant. We had all kind of water coming in and all kind of water going out. Uh, let's go to tools, um, ground monitor. Where are you at? Here we go. Set this guy down over here and get him going. Uh, the thing about the ground mo monitor, when you want to set it down, he's going to be pointing to the left. If you watch, if you uh, if you left click, uh, he's going to be pointing to the left. So uh, if you want to position it the right way, that's how you want to do it. You want to aim your left shoulder at whatever it is you want to put the water on. And there you go. We're good with that. So we'll pick it back up. We'll move it a little bit further away here. That should be good. Perfect. All right. Let's get our line. Check our hose. We'll get our pump going and we should be set. We'll be getting some water on that tank. Uh, let's see. Uh, pump panel, tank fill. Let's pull you. Yeah, it's not much coming in, guys. Not much at all. All right. Tank to pump. We're going to use tank to pump. Um, I'm using that to kind of... Uh, gate the uh i guess gate the output a little bit better is the way it was explained to me and it does work really well as far as that so that's what we're going to do let's do uh we we'll see we're doing discharge two so we'll pull this guy a little bit and let's increase our rpms there we go that's pretty good i think that should be good and our Monitor is going nice. Okay, yeah. Sweet. We're, we're doing good here. We're doing good. All right. Uh, let's see. Let's put some water on it like so. And the effect's a little bit like the animation for the water on the ground monitor is a little bit um, weird. I don't know what the reach is. Like you, This may be reaching it or it may just be the visual reaching it. I'm not sure. I think it is reaching it. But you know what? Just to be safe, we're going to move it just a tad closer because I'm not sure on that. So let's go back to here. Let's go uh, pump panel. Discharge to. Let's push it all the way back in. There we go. And let's try it again here. We'll have to uh, we'll have to disconnect it and do all the things. Uh, disconnect the hose. Set you down there. Doesn't look like it's wanting to work for me. All right, let's move you out of the way over here. He was a little bit too close. There we go. Yeah. All right. Uh, pick you up. Let's put you right here. Now let's get it. I love the ground monitors, guys. These are going to help a lot. These really do help out, especially single player. So that's kind of nice. All right, let's go back. Pump panel. Uh, discharge to pull them open a little bit and increase this some. There we go. All right, we're good with that. We should have water coming off. Nice, nice, nice. We're good. All right, let's go back to you and we'll put you right. There, we'll hit E to exit off. Okay, so we've got water going on to that. We're, we're doing really good with that. Okay, sweet. Um, uh, I think we're going to need another hydrant, though, guys. Like, uh, that one isn't that great. There's one on the corner to the, uh, the southeast side of the fire. That might be one we could go to as well. Our water look like here. 
Uh, 120 coming in. We could boost it to... Um, we could boost it to 240, but our tank's not filling up. I think we're pretty much using as much uh, as we got coming in, so... I, I don't want to bother. Uh, I don't want to bother boosting it because then we'll have to disconnect all this and redo the hydrant and all that stuff. So that would be no bueno. So uh, let's go to let's go to station one, and we'll bring one of his units. Let's see. Let's get engine three. Yeah, we'll do that. Sweet. All right. Tit have to open the door up. L to hit the lights. All right. Let's see. All right. This is gonna be the right way. Okay. That one was wrong way. This one's the right way. Let's kill you, and it's going to be, looks like a yellow top hydrant. I can't remember the pressures on these to save my life, so I couldn't tell you. We'll have to figure out once we get connected to it. We may honestly try boosting off of this and just run our supply over to the tanker from this one instead. Uh, let's see. Let's do, uh, let's go ahead and get our uh, UMAT. Go to tools. Pressure booster. And we'll connect. Uh, looks like I've got some good responses from the last few videos I've done on this. People seem to really dig it. Looks like I said, I know of other people commented that I could pretty much just do the pumping and hose connections. Uh, I love it. I absolutely love this stuff. All right, let's get you hooked up. There we go. All right, let's get our hydrant wrench going. Get him turned on. And let's go pump panel. Now, what for me personally, and this more likely, you know, could very well not be 100% right. I don't know. But for me, on like uh, an engine that's on a hydrant, I generally just do tank fill. Um, you know, there it's like, uh, I'm trying to think of the best way to explain it. Like some, some of these engines, you have more coming out of the hydrant than what they can pump. So... Uh, this one I think can pump 400, maybe. I'm not 100% sure on that. Let's see. Can it do max throttle 350? So it can do just as much as what's coming out of the hydrant. You have some hydrants that'll do more than that. And so it's like the pump can't keep up with it. So I just do tank fill. But usually I just do tank fill for the supply. I don't think there's really need to do, do uh, tank to pump. All right, so we've got him hooked up. Let's do... Um, I have to go to the other... Discharge over here. All right, discharge five. Yeah, we'll grab him. And we'll, there we go. All right, we got him going and let's go ahead. Get discharge five opened up. Pull it all the way. 350 is much better than the 120 on the other hydrant, right? Like that's a really crappy hydrant. All right, so now what we got to do is run an intake from the tanker to uh, to this engine because uh, not even the engine. We have to connect to the uh, boost valve. So uh, I got to think, how is this going to work? I wonder, can I pull another intake while this one is still doing on the other side? We'll see. We'll test this out. I don't know how this will work out. Is there, yes, there is a passenger intake. Nice. All right, we'll grab him. It's going to be a long run. Might we'll have to hand jack it. It's a long ways. Here we go. We're almost there, dude. Just a little bit further. Nice. Okay. I wonder how this is going to work out with the uh, tanker now. It's got two intakes. That means he's got double the water. So we should have, let's see, we had 350 coming out of the hydrant. We're boosting it, so it's going to be doubled to 700. And then is that going to include the 122? Uh, no. Okay. Wait. Yes, we got 820. Nice. So it, it basically, it doubled the hydrant that we just hooked up to at 700. And then we add another 120 from that hydrant down there. So we got 820 coming in now. Sweet. So uh, we're topped off really good. All right, let's go ahead and get our air tank. Let's go uh, gear air pack. Guess we should have done that right off the bat, but nice, nice, nice. This is awesome. I love it. Uh, let's do some more ground monitors. Maybe we'll see. Let's. Uh... We're probably going to have to gain. Yeah, we need to gain access. 
We need to cut these roll up doors and stuff like that. I wonder if we can go ahead and get in this small door right here. Uh, it's locked. You grab a Halligan. We're probably gonna need some more engines. We need to get that other uh, other European style engine. We'll bring him in here. There we go. Lights, headlights. And we need to bring the ladder too. Absolutely need to bring the ladder. And County got a real good deal on this style of engines. They got them cheap, so while we're using them, we're gonna run all over our line, so don't freak out. It'll be okay. It doesn't hurt them in game. All right, see where could we put this guy? Let's put him. Put him right here. Let's start getting. Uh, let's start gaining entry. Let's grab a Halligan. Tools, uh, Halligan. Yeah, yeah, Mart. Still caught on fire. I didn't even realize it was yeah, yeah, Mart. Wait, there we go. Yeah, we got some fires down there for sure. It's fully involved. All right, let's drop you down. Drop him across the street. We'll go get the tiller ladder. Get our saw and stuff. Uh, let's see. Fire stations for a tiller. Nice. Let's get that going. All right. Got to steer it with the mouse. I got to remember how to do this. It's been yeah, the wrong way. Other way. There we go. Have to do it with your left and right uh, mouse button. <laughs> it gets a little tricky. Tiller ladders are always a, a handful single player. Like they really just are. Try to get in front here if we can. There we go. All right, let's hop out and get this guy set up. Get our outriggers down. And while we do that, it should be coming now. There we go. While it does that, I think we're going to grab a saw. You know what? Actually, scratch that. We're going to use the uh, forcible entry team. So let's do that. Let's go to emergencies. Let's. Uh, I should have taken this call right off the bat. We didn't do that, but. All right, we got units established. Let's uh, take command. Let's upgrade to uh, we'll do a second, maybe. There we go. Second alarm. Exit out of you, get out of this. Let's see, we are going to need to hit in now to go to drone camera mode or command mode. And what do we got? I'm curious to see if they'll uh, if they'll actually do this. Let's do, um, do primary search. Let's do writs and let's do a forcible entry. Uh, actually, I don't think forcible entry is going to work. We need to do saw team. Never mind. Let's do them. There we go. Hopefully, they'll get those doors. I'm not sure. Maybe. Maybe demolition should have been the one. Let's. Um, all right. Forcible entry went away. So let's do. I can't remember which one does it. This way. Maybe this one. No, they're venting the windows. Demolition's venting the windows. Saw is not doing anything. We may have to cut those doors ourselves. Yeah, he's going ham on the windows though, so good job on him. Uh, yeah, let's just grab a saw. We'll do it ourselves. Go to gear. Partner saw is what we're going to be looking for. Yeah, I don't think he's going to do it. Yeah, well, they are doing something, but... You want something done right, you do it yourself, right? Like, this is what we need to do. There we go. Sweet. All right. We're good with that. Let's put this saw back away. Got gear, partner saw. Uh, let's go to tools, grab some ladders. Let's get a 24 foot ladder. Wonder, uh, we may put them on the adjoining building here, actually. 
Too close, right? Sweet, there we go. Worked out perfect. Let's do that. Let's grab the 12 foot. We'll put it in a window. Or an escape. Or the 14, I should say. 14 foot ladder, not 12. 14. Put him right here. Nice. All right. And uh, then we'll set up our artillery as well. Seems like the uh, the motion of the ladders has been slowed down a little bit, maybe. It could be my mind playing tricks on me. It's weird. Every time the game updates, I start kind of like second guessing everything. I'm like, did that change? Did that, did that change? That seems slower to me, but... I don't know. It could it could very well be the same. All right, let's go to the end here. There we go. All right, let's go back. And we'll hop down. Sweet. Okay, we're good. Now, let's get some more ground monitors set up. Let's do that. Let's do uh Let's do 6 and 5. Let's do six because we've got a ton of water coming in. That's good. We got uh, a good bit of water. Not as much as I had the other night when I had the five monitors going, but we've got we've got a little water coming in. All right, let's drop you here. I think we'll just do three. I don't think we'll worry about. We won't go crazy with five. We'll do the three. Uh, ground monitor. That's what we need. All right, as you remember, shoulder pointing to where you want your uh, stream to go, so got that. Let's pick this guy back up. Go to you. It pointed a little bit better there. All right, let's get our water going for this one. What did I say? This is going to be six, right? Yeah, I think uh, the other night when I had the five monitors going, I had over uh, 1,200 coming in. I want to say that's what it was. Um, Six. Which one is six? This is going to be six right here. Uh, actually, let's exit out of this real fast. Let's go to first person. Uh, where's... All right, there's six at the bottom. All right, let's go back. Pump panel... There we go. All right, sweet. I think the minimum is 120 for these, something like that. 100, 120. Nice, we got water going in, sweet, look at that. Very cool, let's get back over here to it. There, right, we'll exit out of you. Let's get one more going. There we go. Yeah, I really like the ground monitors. Like, this is an awesome update, guys. I'm telling you right now. This is really, really nice. Uh, kind of wish I hadn't put that ladder there now. We have to move that. All right, shoulder pointing to where we want the water to go. Let's drop him right here. We'll get five. And we'll stretch him over. There we go, five. Yeah, we're going to move that ladder. We already done our search and everything anyway, so it shouldn't really... shouldn't really matter. Let's just drop you right here. Alright, let's get this other monitor going. We'll be set. Okay, pump panel, and we're looking for five. Actually, I keep forgetting to go to first person mode. I like first person mode because you can see everything a little bit better this way. A little bit closer, there we go. All right, pump panel five, let's pull you. There we go. All right, so uh, we only got 360 going out, so I mean, really, technically, we could do uh, we could do all the ground monitors if we wanted to.
Right, let's grab this guy. We'll get him. We'll start hitting it. Yeah, I'm not sure about the range on these things. I'm, that's the only thing I'm kind of iffy about. I don't know what the range is. It doesn't look like it's really having an effect on the fire. I could be wrong. But it doesn't look like it's having an effect. Get down a little bit here. Down a little bit more. There we go. Yeah, I I don't know. I don't know if it's having an effect, guys. It it doesn't does it appear to be, but I'm not certain on that. All right, do we have any more hydrants around here? Uh, we've got the one on the corner. We got another one down the street from it, just a little bit. Um, I think we need another engine and another hydrant. I do believe. I think what we're going to do is go down there to uh, the hydrants to the left, or I mean to the right of the one on the southeast corner, hook up to it. I don't think we're going to boost it though. All right, let's go to station five. And let's grab engine two. All right, there's a fire scene. We're gonna go and buy it. Go the wrong way here. Grab this hydrant on the corner. Hopefully it's going to have, uh, gonna be decent. I don't know, it looks like a red top. No, it's not. It's yellow, so this should be pretty good, too. All right, let's kill that. You know, we may honestly boost this one, too. We have a little bit more water. I think we're going to do that. I think we're going to boost this one. All right, let's uh, hop out. Uh, let's see. Get our boosting valve. All right, hook you up. Go passenger intake. Yeah, I love it. If if you guys can't tell, I just really do love the side of the setup. That's why I'm like going to so many hydrants. You know, <laughs> like we need another hydrant. <laughs> Let's see, five. Yeah, we'll go with five on this one. There we go. All right, let's get him going. All right, let's pull. Thank Phil. <clears throat> 270 on this one, so a little bit less. I think it's a range. I think each different uh, hydrant color has a range associated with it as far as like what you could get out of it. So not quite as good as the other one, but 270 for this one, so. All right, so we've got that set up. Let's, um, uh, I'm trying to think of what we could do here. We're gonna need some more equipment. All right, we're bringing engine one from um, the county from station two. That's one of the great things I love about this game is we don't have to worry about the fires going out. So we can kind of uh, play around with it and do what we want and uh, just let it do its thing, so. That's uh, that's really nice. Let's go, I think right here, a good spot. I say, and once again, I say engine one is actually engine two, but it's engine style one that's, uh, oh man, we can't stretch through here. I thought we could, we got that fence in the way. Engine model one, but it's gonna be number two from uh, station two. Honestly, I kinda wish, uh, I wish the engines could have their own unique numbers apart from the station that they're at. So like you could have a 280 or a 250 or a 310 or an engine four or five, you know, like, you know what I'm saying? Like they could be just completely separate from the station. So you say, uh, bring engine uh, 280, you know, just do that. Five is yellow. Yeah. That's, uh, the colors are a little messed up on that. All right, yeah, five is actually yellow. It's not brown, so the colors are mixed up just a tad. Push you in and do five. All right, that should have us charged up. 
Sweet. All right, we're good to go. We're boosted. Let's uh, shoot. I should have brought that uh, supply line with me. Hey, here we are. Let's get him hooked up. And we should be good. Yeah, we're good to go. All right, let's teleport back to the uh, to the engine. See, it's going to be station two, engine one. There we go. Sweet. All right, what else can we do? We got fire on the roof. We're doing a good job cooling our, uh, our propane tank here. I think that's pretty much a non-issue. Uh, we're hitting it from the front. Our saw team is still cutting something. I don't know what they're busy cutting, but they are busy doing something. Um, I wonder, can we... Do we have access on these stairs out here? No, we don't. So it must have a uh, internal staircase or something to get to that second floor. All right, let's bring another ladder. Let's get... Uh, Let's see station five ladder one we'll bring him we'll use him to uh, hit the roof with some water because we got tons of water now like we've got water for days not issue all right here we are ladder one we'll get this guy set up right here sweet let's hop out and we'll get him set up the other day when we tried it I couldn't get it hooked up but I think you can now we'll see There we go. All right, he's good on that. Uh, let's see about getting... I don't know how this works. All right, he does have an intake. All right. And we grab it from here. And then run it to discharge. And we should be set. But does he have another discharge? It's the only thing. Uh, small. He doesn't have a large... Okay, yeah, we'll use the large on this side. Uh, we'll do discharge five. Yeah, it's showing five is brown. That's not correct on the panel is yellow, so that's definitely something that's a little amiss. All right, let's go uh, first person. Oh, panel. Let's uh, let's ramp her up. Let's just do max throttle and let's do uh, tank fill. Yeah, she got some water coming in and then let's do tank to pump. And let's do five. I right, got water going out, water coming in. Uh, we can manage it with our uh, throttle here. So we're good with that. And the line should be charged going to the ladder. Nice. All right. So we should have water. We should be in business. Yeah, we got water. Nice, nice, nice. Uh, why is it spraying already, though? Oh, it's going to be Q, right? Q, no. Uh, good question. I don't know. Try this again. Yeah, we got a uh, constant water stream here. That's all right, though. We'll work with this. Yeah, let's go up a little bit and out. They're still cutting. I don't know what that dude... He's been cutting for like the past 30 minutes. I don't know what he's cutting on, but he is working hard. All right, there we go. Let's hit, uh, let's toggle the ladder pipe and let's get the water on it here. Sweet, sweet, sweet. I love it. I love it. This is probably one of the better scenes I think we've had in the game. I really do. Let's go to, uh, let's go to drone camera mode and uh, just kind of admire it a little bit here. Take it all in. There we go. I wish we could pull all that down to get some uh, aerial screenshots, but we can't. It'd be nice if we could, but look at that. Man, that looks good, right? Like, we've got all kind of stuff going on. Love Tanker 2. It's my new favorite in the entire game. Tanker 2 is now my favorite. It's a beast. Like, uh, if you have good water coming in, you can supply all sorts of things, so... Really nice. Look at there. we got three monitors going, three ground monitors going, a ladder going. 
got tiller set up to the adjoining roof i mean if we needed to we could put some guys up there I, we could do all kind of stuff man nice it's nice i love it all right i need to see about getting some screenshots there we go now we got a few screenshots i think what we're gonna do is we're gonna let uh Keith Spurs going to assess the situation here, and I think what we're going to do is start working on the roof. Yeah, I think we're going to go back to the ladder, start working on him. I want to do this purely exterior. It just doesn't seem like the monitors, the ground monitors, are having any effect on the fire in there. All right, let's go up here, and let's start moving this water around a little bit. Well, somehow he managed to vent that roof. With all the fire around it, he managed to do it, so that's good at least. There we go. We'll have the roof knocked out in a second here. Come on, just a little bit more. I know we can get it. Sweet. All right, one more. Oh, I love it. I really do. The setup is so fun, and I just love the fact that we're able to have the time we need to be able to do that. You know, to, to set it up as involved as we want to, to get as involved as we want to with it, and then, um... Yeah, we can't cut this off. I guess, uh, I'm not sure. How do they work in real life? Can they control it from the ladder, or uh, is it from the engine? I want to assume it's from the ladder. But I'm not 100% certain on that. But e either way, we're going to go ahead and kill it. At the engine. Right, let's do pump, uh, pump panel, discharge five. And... Oops. That's six. There we go. There we go. All right, that should be good right there. Let's exit back out. Do we have a, a... Okay, yeah, we do have a door back here. Oh, there's our staircase to the... Other floor. Okay. Uh, looks like we got some fires in the back here as well. Oh, let's not go into the monitor stream. That would be bad. All right, we got our Halligan. We're going to pop this back door real fast. Oh, it's already open. Never mind. Never mind then. All right, let's drop you down. And do we need to do the second floor too? I think it's already open. Yeah, I think they got it. Okay, let's get a hand light. Let's start working ourselves now. Let's do... Uh, Connections. Uh, let's see. What kind of tip do we want to use? We want to use uh, smooth or combination. I think we're going to go to combination. We'll do discharge one. And let's drop them down right here. We'll take care of a pump panel. Nope. Nope. Not that. All right. Discharge one. Let's pull. Um, Ooh, 144. I think that's too much. Let's decrease the throttle just a little bit here. We'll do like, um, what is it, 120? Maybe? maybe that might be too much. I can't remember the exact number. I know if you if you put too much on it, you uh, you won't be able to move around. It'll it'll stick you in place. So, all right, let's squat down, and we have no water. Why do we not have any water on this? There we go. Discharge two, we have water. I don't know what's up with one. That was kind of weird. I had to go play around with it. I had to put uh, the line back away. Uh, of course, turn discharge one off and then um, pull off the discharge two. So, I don't know. That was kind of weird. There we go. We got that out. Let's hop up. Let's see if there's anything upstairs. Uh, looks like we're good upstairs. All right, we're going back around front. We're going to hit our monitors real fast. Yeah, I see. Maybe it did knock it out. It seems like maybe it did. Let's see. Can we get it? Can we get it through the door here? We'll see if this works. Uh, maybe so. It looks like it is actually. Uh, I don't know. It's hard to tell. There's some way back there in the back. Let's jump off of you. Yeah, there's some stubborn fires back there in the back. Looks like the uh, chip aisle's on fire. All right, let's grab a hand line. 
we'll we'll knock that out with a headline. Taker four luckily has one headline too, so we can do that as well. We'll grab one off of him. We've got plenty of water, so we're good on that. I did not know you could double intake. That's the first time I've ever done that on this game, so that's pretty cool. Connections, let's go uh, discharge one. Let's do smooth bore. Actually, no, we can't do that. Let's go back, put you away. Now do smooth bore. Now do discharge one, and we should have it. Yes, all right. All right, let's drop you right here and get him going. Pump panel discharge one. Where you at? Yard. Let's pull you. I can't see. All right, there we go. Discharge one's pink. We got twelve on it. All right, let's uh, finish that up. There you go, 120, nice. Pick you up, and we'll go do our thing. Do we have water? Yes, we do have water, nice. All right. Let's go finish this up. Chief's uh, been busy today. He's done it all. He's done everything. See if we can get it from the window here. We're going to have to go inside and get it, yeah. Come on, do it. It keeps coming back. Yeah, it looks like it's going to go out and then it keeps flaring back up. I was hoping we could do this purely exterior, but it doesn't look to be that way. All right, we're going to have to, yeah. Yeah, I think so. We're going to have to go in the back door and do it. All right, well, that's fine. I guess I could be part of the mop up. We're going to go ahead and kill these ground monitors. We're going to keep it kind of legit because I don't see them going in with those running. So let's do that. Let's go pump panel. Uh, I think it's going to be five and six, right? Yeah, there we go. We're coming down our pressure a little bit. Five, six. There we go. What's the 240 going to? Uh, good question. Let's look at this. Uh, two. Two is still open as well, even though we're not using... I mean, one. One is still... Oh, two is still open. Two is open. When did I open two? I didn't know I opened two. Let's go ahead and close it off. There we go. We'll leave one going, because that's going to our hand line. Yeah, I don't know... Oh, two is the, uh, no, one of these is, no, 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 no. We need to open two back up. That's going to our tank. Never mind, I forgot about that. Uh, two, let's open you back up quick. There we go. All right, sweet. That should get our... Okay, yeah, I forgot. I briefly forgot we had three ground monitors going instead of just, uh, two. All right, make sure we got water. That's interesting. I picked this up and it changed from a combination nozzle to uh, a smooth bore. I guess that's because that's the last one I selected. All right, let's get in here. Let's hit it. Yeah, it's just that one little stubborn spot right here. There we go. All that for that. <laughs> we finally got it. The candy bars, they're on fire. That sucks. And some uh, aerosols and stuff too. We're being burned. How are we being burned? We got some hidden fires in here. We may have to let our AI dudes hit it. And this poor saw guy, like, we're going to have to give him a rest because that dude has been at it the entire time. There we go. Under control. One Park Street is under control, guys. We got it. We got it. That was fun. We boosted two hydrants. Uh, we connected to a third hydrant. We had ladder ops. We had ground monitors. We had the big, um, we'll call it the super tanker. Tanker number two is a super tanker because damn, it can supply just about everything you need uh, as long as you've got the water coming in. That is really awesome. If you can boost from a good hydrant into that thing, you're set. Man, I, I mean, it's got everything you need. Anyway. 
that's going to do it for this one guys i hope y'all enjoyed if you did please be sure to hit that like subscribe ring that bell leave me a comment let me know what you think of the gameplay and uh, the new pumping features we're coming up on 4,000 subs guys it absolutely blows my mind i think i just hit uh, 3700 yesterday it slowed down a little bit this month had a huge month uh back between april into may uh, and then it slowed down coming out towards the end of May, which doesn't surprise me. Usually after a big boost, you have a decline. But uh, either way, I really do appreciate it. Love all you guys. And uh, we'll see you on the streets of Canton County next time. Peace.